hello and welcome to what are you saying hashtag ways where we talk about topics in the news as it affects us all i am osaiwa misale and today i have the lovely sandra eze how are you hello. drum roll how are you doing hello. i've missed you this week I've seen you i have week. as well um i decided to um tell your path team natural hair i was like whenever you guys see me wearing natural hair just now i'm clueless what to do with my hair so yeah that's a secret <laughs> uh, it's a choice for me it's not it's not choice <laughs> so but well, um well it looks good it does look good i have to admit it it's just the stress mm. of edge control eco styler gel and just it's just too much and i'm not like a girly girl mm. yeah i'm like just hair wigs on just just move on. Oh. <laughs> but how have you been outside of the hair? Lagos rains and all of that. Um, I've been. It's. Uh, I haven't been as busy as you know before the Corona era, but um, yeah, life is good. God has been good, and yeah. Well, I wanted to share this stuff about. Um, I saw online. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Adele. Um, a fan, Adele put up a post, and then a fan commented and said oh my goodness give us a teaser when are you bringing out a new music a new song just something from you and Adele said wear your mask and be patient <laughs> <laughs> and I think that is so apt very, uh, very know, apt because though. people people don't realize that one of the most hit people by this COVID is also entertainers especially like music artists mm -hmm. the actors they can still find a way to work i think a lot of people are working on the ground especially in states not so affected but for musicians you have to hold concerts you have to actually go for performances and um they can't do that anymore mm. that's why people like the band on naramali would have to sneak around to uh, you know because they have to pay they have they have to make money absolutely yeah all right so today is the honorable minister for works and housing uh, <laughs> that's his birthday 28th of june um baba tunde raji fashola i'm so happy for, for for how far god has you know blessed him and so I want to wish him a happy birthday in fact he was supposed to be on ways today Aww. you know but because of his birthday he has a lot of commitment so we're hoping to host him next week friday so remember to tune in it's going to be an interesting conversation it's like a lot of birthday people like a, a lot, lot of, of june, june babies born. yes yeah a lot of another them. gentleman um, tiwala day um mm -hmm. tiwala day is um the ceo of dot media Mm. He's also today his is also his birthday and you know he was the one that actually introduced me to Plus TV Africa. Oh, lovely. You know, so Oh yeah, I remember TJ. T -T -T -J. Oh my god. <laughs> so there is T J, there's Mr. K, yes. Fashola, Joshua Selman, Samuel Lula. Like, too many and then two of my siblings too. Plenty of young birthday ones as well. Oh. Come uh, on, what I mean, is it about June babies? A lot of June babies. Oh wow, <laughs> there's a lot of June babies. So happy birthday! Happy birthday! All happy all birthday! Yes. Yeah, so um, hmm, here's what we found as today's quote: Peace in patriarchy is war against women. That's from Maria Mir. What do you think? I think that's very subtle, but loud. Very loud. You know, um, when I heard it uh, before before the show started, I was like, go. Oh, Hold on, what, what was that again? It's like it just flies by you. You have to go back and to, under again. to understand. It's so, powerful. so it's like if if you see nothing wrong with patriarchy, you're obviously just saying um, I'm, I'm against women. Yeah. yeah, because being at peace means like nothing is wrong. It's okay. It's like even not speaking up is a sign that you're at peace mm -hmm. with it. Mm -hmm. You know, absolutely. Because yesterday we discussed violence um, against women, and as a second part of that conversation, today we are exploring patriarchy as it affects our society. For this roundtable conversation, it's a special one today because we've never had it. We have Uti, Nasa, and AK to talk to us. They are co-anchors on Ways. And uh, but first, we'll take a quick break for what's in the news.